but I'm having the worst hair day ever. Hello everybody, it's Emily and today I'm going to be doing a video which I have been planning for a long time now. Before I start, I just want to give full credit to a YouTuber called Saf and I will link her channel in the description because she is the one that gave me full inspiration to film this video and do this video. So over the past two or three weeks, I have been ordering things from Instagram, Snapchat and Facebook. And today I'm going to be opening everything and reviewing things and I'm just actually so excited to film this video because I've been waiting a while to do it. I bought everything when I decided I wanted to look, but these are all the first like five things I saw. So let's just get started. Right, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take you through everything I bought. I actually didn't pre-film this. I should have filmed this whilst I was actually scrolling through and looking for the things. But I'm just gonna be showing you everything that I bought and then we're gonna open everything. Okay, so the first thing I bought was on Facebook and they were these lipstick things, I think. I can't actually remember. I feel like I bought more than one, but I don't remember now. They're like, what's the word? Lip tints or lip stains? Lip stains. So I bought those. That is the first thing that I did buy. I don't remember what colors I got now. Okay, so the next thing I bought was from Cabra's. It was like a milk tray box of chocolates and I like customized them. I wrote like, I can't remember what I wrote now. What did I write? I'm not gonna show you what I wrote. I'll show you when I open them, but yeah. Okay, so the next thing was on Instagram and you've probably all heard of Shein. Um, it was recommended to me. It's basically clothes. They're actually really cheap. So what I did was I actually bought a top from this website and yeah. Okay, so the next thing was Snapchat. Now these are recommended to me all the time. This is a makeup brush set and apparently it was changed from £52.77 to £15. So it's just a makeup brush set. I got that, so yeah. And the final thing that I bought were a pair of boots. Now I don't wear boots, okay? I don't wear boots and I was like, I'm not gonna be able to buy any boots. But you know, this was recommended to me so I obviously had to buy some and I bought these actual really nice ones. I don't know if I'm gonna wear them, I might sell them, but yeah, let's just see what they're like when they when I open them. Sorry if that was really short and like brief. I actually just want to open things and show you guys what I've bought because I find that so interesting. Like, I'm just so excited. But I'm just looking back through the video and I realized that the back of my hair is sticking up. Like why how has that happened? So I'm very sorry because it's annoyed me so much. So the first thing I am going to be opening, I don't know, it's in this box. I'm gonna show you the other side where I am. It's just in this box. I actually need to get scissors. Okay. I feel like I'm just breaking whatever's in this Ow. I know, right. So it says, black brush made in China. Now this is the makeup brush set that I ordered. Why does it look like a book or something? Right, so it's just, I hate that noise. I, oh my gosh, no way. This was 15 pounds for all of these makeup brushes. Like I'm not even joking. It really, it feels so bad, I'm not gonna lie. But basically, I've got a huge fan brush, then I've got like foundation brushes, eyeshadow brushes, and then it goes down to eyebrows. So I'm gonna just try this fan brush for highlight. I'm just gonna go for it. We're gonna be using the Laura Geller. It's just not picking up anything on here. Oh my God. It's just literally not picking up. Right, even is, is a fan brush really for highlight? I don't think it is. I feel like I'm using a fan brush for the wrong thing, but this isn't picking up any product at all. Right, so I'm just gonna use this brush, which is just like a regular eyeshadow brush for like the main color, not for like blending or anything. Right, this is picking up. I mean, that is pretty good. Like that is quite a lot of pigment, but that is quite a pigmented color. No, that's doing quite good. I think the last brush I'm gonna test is just the classic foundation brush. Like, I don't use foundation brushes like this. I use like a kabuki one, but I'm just gonna use my foundation and see how this blends right here. So, 
right. That is not blending in, is it? So I'm just gonna do a bit on my face right here. It doesn't look streaky, but I haven't done it on my whole face again. I just did it a tiny bit on here. The quality of like the bristles aren't that great. But I mean, that is quite a lot of makeup brushes for £15, so I'm not complaining. So the next thing I am going to be opening... Whoop. Oh my god. No, surely. That is the cutest box ever. It's pink. So, inside it's just got like tissue paper. Right. I did not realise they were going to be this colour. They are so bright. I'll put a picture of the actual boots right here. You might not be able to tell. They have a really strong smell to them. I'm not complaining completely because these are really cheap, but the like stitching on them is like coming off and it's like, there's like threads. I don't know if you can see. It's not a good zip. I can't really complain until I've tried these on. So I'm gonna try them on right now and then I'm gonna do a close up of them actually on my feet. I have one word for these guys, and the word is no. These, these are the most uncomfortable things I've ever put on in my, like I'm actually gonna break my ankle, like no. I'm gonna have to take these off right now. Just bearing in mind guys, I don't ever wear anything this style, like they are not my style at all, but like I had to buy a pair because they're recommended to me. Okay, so the next thing, I'm just gonna go for this. Now I'm actually really excited for this because I've been waiting to open these for so long, I feel like they're gonna be out of date. Ow, I just cut my finger. Oh my god! Okay, so it has my personalised message on the front. It says like and sub, and then it says if you want a free chocolate. That is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my entire- I am going to save this forever. It's so cute! They're so cute. I'm going to have a strawberry one because Strawberry is my fave, so. The next thing is this. Oh my god, my finger's bleeding. This is cute. This is so cute! I hate it when clothes come in, like the really crinkly, like plastic. I hate this. Right. No, oh, the material. Oh, I didn't realise it was cropped. That is cute. That is actually very cute. So this is the top. Now, this is meant to be a one size fits all. And I am really skinny. And this like barely fits me. Like look how short the sleeves are. How is this gonna fit anyone else? Like it's cropped, but like I was expecting that. It is see-through, kind of. But I quite like it. I don't know if I'm gonna wear it again, but like, I do quite like it, I'm not going to lie. Okay, and the final thing that I'm going to be opening is this. Oh my god, that's so cute. It's got a little, like, stick on that. Okay. Oh, so I ordered two of these. And, like, the packet that says, like, a Ziploc bag. So here are the two little lip things I got. I got two right here. They are the cutest things ever they are packaged so nicely i actually really love the packaging that they've come in that is so 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 cute so this is the first one and it's in the shade leo which is like a brown kind of color and i got like quite a dark color because i wanted to be able to show the color on my lips so i'm gonna do it and then i'm gonna show you but i mean it is only a lip stain but you can't really see it and it's kind of like meant to be this colour. Gonna, I mean from this far away maybe you can see it a bit more. I don't know, I'll have to see when I'm editing but like in real life you can see it. It's quite subtle but I think that's what I was expecting anyway. Right, so this is the next one and it's in the shade, it's in the shade Zip. Actually that is a really nice colour, it's really red. Oh, I hate lipstick. I hate myself with lipstick on. I hate lipstick. But this is a really, really, really good lipstick. Like, I'm not going to lie. Oh, my gosh. That is so good. Basically, I couldn't get that lipstick off. I've just tried and, like, you can still kind of see it. So, 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did remember to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already and I will see you guys very soon. Bye! One,